Lineage Name Service or Lineage Name Register is the very first NFT smart contract on Ethereum and it's really cool. So I've just recorded a video about that yesterday and there have been a bunch of development since then because the community is amazing. A lot of people are working on that right now and the number of domains registered went from uh, 200,000 yesterday to over 300,000 right now. Uh, so it grew by 50% uh, since yesterday, which is really, really crazy. Uh, also the number of holders of register of registrants went from uh, 6,000 uh, 6, to 12,000. So it doubled uh, also within one day. Basically the whole thing got discovered two days ago. It's super new. Uh, so it's probably your best chance to really register cool, a domain on a historical smart contract. So the domain will be of course fresh, new and it will be brand new, but the contract is really uh, coming from 2015, from August of 2015. Uh, so it has this historical provenance and it's really cool. So right now, uh, you have the proper domain for uh, registering the domain as before. Uh, the proper name is lineage uh, name register.com uh, and you can do a bunch of things. So for example, you can uh, already wrap uh, your domain. Uh, you can uh, wrap and unwrap it, also transfer to a particular address. Uh, and after wrapping, basically you are able to uh, trade the domains on OpenSea, which is really cool. So. Thanks to that, the volume is already growing. Uh, it just launched like a couple of hours ago, uh, I think like eight hours ago, and there's already like 100 ETH of volume. Uh, people are trading everything. Uh, of course, beware uh, for what you're buying. I think it's not yet um, well described because for example, uh, because you can have spaces uh, in uh, uh, this .og uh, name service, then uh, people are trying to do things like just put single number and then a bunch of spaces so you won't see it and, and so on. So always beware of what you're buying. Uh, always ask the community because there's also right now the official Discord uh, plus official Twitter. Uh, it's really cool. People are super helpful. If you have any questions, you can, you can see it there. As you can see, uh, you can start buying domains which are both um, classical domains, just uh, standard characters, as well as, uh, for example, spaces, as in this case, or different emojis as here with the moon. Uh, so it's really cool. Uh, moreover, there's, uh, there's more, uh, there's uh, one person prepared a Dune Analytics website. Uh, so this is a bunch of dashboards related to how many total registrations, as you can see, there's uh, over 300,000 uh, total domains registered and it grew really quickly. It started all on uh, 30th September and it went to uh, over 300,000 right now, almost 350,000 uh, and there's over, over 12,000 of unique holders uh, and there's a bunch of fees and there's, you can also see the leaderboard who owns the most, the person with the most registered domains have 2,200 domains. Um, and if you go below, then you can see there are a bunch of people with a couple hundreds of domains. You can see of the, the name checks, uh, check directly what's for the existing names, the wallets, who's the owner of that, uh, which is pretty cool. There's also a sales tracker. Uh, people are working on the sales tracker also on the bot on Twitter. So that's going to be cool. Uh, there's some kind of a comparison between LNR and ENS, uh, Ethereum name service. Uh, and there's this cool graph coming from Leonidas with all the historical NFTs and right now rediscover domain name. And as you can see, it's really, really one of the first because uh, Ethereum launched on the last day uh, of like 30th July of 2015. And this contract was uh, deployed on 8th August 2015. So just after uh, a little bit more than a week uh, since the, the launch of the mainnet of Ethereum, which is amazing. Uh, so curious about the name, according to the creator, Lineage is combination of Linux, the operating system and Apogee, the early game studio that created Wolfenstein 3D. Uh, cool thing, uh, there's two links also coming from this Dune. Uh, you can go directly to the Discord, uh, either the official Discord or the Discord for, for the NFT archaeology. This is the group of people who are looking for uh, smart contracts like that. Uh, to, to just to recall, uh, Lineage was uh, discovered by M. Keresti. Uh, he went and just downloaded the first 300,000 contracts and basically ran reverse engineering to try uh, 
uh, rediscover what those contracts are because not all contracts are verified on Etherscan, so you don't know what they're doing. And this is the way he found out about this uh, smart contract. Uh, then he dug a little bit deeper and found that on Reddit, there's actually from seven years ago, uh, Lineage was writing about uh, this particular smart contract and how to use it and about the whole name service. Uh, so he managed to do that. And then the funny thing is Lineage actually came back to Twitter. Uh, he, verifi he verified himself on uh, Reddit. Uh, so you, he posted as the OP on Reddit on his uh, his own uh, post and then redirected to the Twitter to the Twitter profile, which is really cool. You can also follow Lineage. I don't know if he's going to be involved in any way. Um, I heard on Space on Twitter Spaces uh, run by Leonidas that uh, he's working on different AI stuff, but he he's really uh, happy about the whole name service coming back. So it's really cool piece of uh, NFT history coming back. Uh, I really love it. Really uh, recommend looking at that. Uh, also for the, for the, uh, if you're careful about security and you should be, uh, use a burner wallet. It's super easy to create a new wallet in MetaMask, just one click. Uh, use a new wallet for, for uh, interacting with this contract because Still, we are, the, the contract is not verified. We're not sure about uh, what might be the issues, potential exploits and so on. So be careful. It's super fresh, super new, super exciting, but as well might be a little bit dangerous in the end. We don't know. So always be careful. In the end, it's uh, crypto in the early days. So anything can be an exploit. Uh, so yeah, uh, have a look at that. I put, put all the links down below in the, in the description, in the, in the top comment probably also. So have a, the, the link to the analytics, the link to the website, the link to the OpenSea as well. Uh, so you can see what people are minting, what people are registering and how fast the number of registrants are growing. Because the cool thing is that ENS allows you only to register a domain for a given period of time, measured in years. Uh, LNR allows you to register your domain forever. So you pay once and you hold the domain forever. You don't have to worry about whether the, the domain will uh, end uh, in, the, in a year or so. Uh, you don't have to pay the recurring fees. Uh, it's there forever. You pay the gas cost once and you have it. So that's the coolest thing ever. Uh, thank you for watching. Subscribe to the channel for more crypto news, crypto alpha and more updates. Uh, I'm planning to basically record every single day or every other day. Uh, so far, so good. Uh, so thank you for all the support and see you in the next episode.